Hello, my name is Michael Griggs. I'm the Director of Clinical Services for Brayas. And uh, over the next couple of minutes, I just want to quickly go over how to uh, set up the Vivo 65 with a dual limb circuit. So what you're going to need is a couple of things. Uh, you'll need a dual limb circuit and you're going to need one of these exhalation valves. Um, <clears throat> so the Vivo 65 does not require a proprietary circuit. Okay, so as long as the dual limb circuit uh, that you attach to the Vivo 65 passes the pre-use test procedure, uh, you can um, uh, confidently use uh, that type of circuit. But the other thing that you're going to need when you use a dual limb circuit on the Vivo 65 is you're going to need the exhalation valves. And these are our two exhalation valve inserts. This is the adult uh, insert and as you can see here on the uh, side of the valve there is a large um, well uh, a person larger person on that uh, valve as opposed to a smaller person on this valve so this is our pediatric valve and this is our adult valve now the use of these valves do not have uh, anything to do with the size of the patient or the age of the patient you want to use these valves <coughs> excuse me based on the um, based on the parameters that you, uh, based on the settings that you will want to achieve with the uh, Vivo 65. So for instance, a set tidal volume over 300 mLs, um, you're going to need to use the adult valve. Okay, so we're going to use the adult valve in this instance. Um, these valves, everything is measured within the valve. Uh, any water uh, that happens to move into these valves will get channeled away from the ventilator. Okay, so uh, the inserts or the way you you put your place the insert into the device is uh, simply they only go in one way um, and they just simply slide in to the device and then you're going to take this plastic ring and then move it to the right into the lock position and now the exhalation valve is in place. To remove, you are going to just simply click the outer ring to the left to unlock, and that will allow you to remove the valve. Okay, so that is now in place. As far as the um, as far as the uh, dual limb circuit itself, uh, you can take your inspiratory limb and connect it to the machine. You can then take the expiratory limb and connect that to your exhalation valve. I'm going to go ahead and um, connect our test lung to the circuit like so and uh, that is how you set the um, Vivo 65 up in the uh, dual limb circuit configuration.